Transferring money back and forth among accounts when you're in the middle of a mortgage process can pose a little bit of a challenge when you're going through the mortgage process. We're going to talk about that today. Transferring money when you're trying to buy a house among checking, savings, and other accounts can be a little tricky. So today we're going to discuss exactly how you want to get this accomplished. So transferring money when you're in the middle of a mortgage process poses a bit of a problem when your bank statements don't match up. So what I'm referring to is when you look at your checking statement dates, say January 1st through January 31st, and your savings statements say January 15th to February 15th, we won't be able to see the same activity dates on those statements. It's very important for us to be able to match everything up so that we can see the from account and the to account. So how do we avoid this problem of the dates not matching? It's very simple. All you need to do is go online, get activity date range printouts done for yourself on the dates that are missing. The best bet is to make sure that those dates match up to each other. So if you're doing a January 1st through the 31st online for checking, do a January 1st through 31st online for savings. That way we can see the back and forth motion going for to and from each account. I hope that these series of loan tips are helping you in your process. And our next video that we're going to be doing is on gifts. So definitely want to keep an eye out for that video.